sessions have been all about coming together and discovering our community pulse. Or to put it plainly, finding out that anyone can make music and that you can make music with anything. In this case, we're using decommissioned balance boxes. Some of them go all the way back to 1928 and they're being decommissioned because they're really old and really heavy and they have sharp pointy corners and they're being turned into uh, plastic ones for the modern era of democracy. And what we're doing is showing that they can have a new life and hopefully get kids to sort of have a look at them. I've never seen one up close before, you know. And as you can see, they've been doing incredible artwork with them. Uh, and we're also making music. So we're using them as drums. But they look absolutely fantastic. All of them are different in terms of their artwork. And they all sound different as well. And everyone who's playing them are different people too. So all those differences are coming together and actually making really great music. Everyone's been uh, very enthusiastic and engaged, which is great. There's something about working as a team that gives a particular sense of satisfaction. And there's something about playing music that gets you working as a team without thinking that you're doing something a bit dry. We have been having discussions about democracy and what that means, and freedom, really, the freedom to do things that maybe in other societies you can't. And we've been finding out all sorts of interesting things along the way um, about practical things, not even about the big concepts of democracy, but stuff like you can't get direct debit or a good credit rating if you're not on the electoral roll, which for in the places that we're working in is actually very pertinent because we're, we're living in kind of sheltered housing and people who are transitioning into their adult lives. And that's really, really important stuff that none of us knew about, the people who are organising this. So lots of things have been coming out. We have had uh, a couple of guys saying, you know what? think of my vote. I mean if it you know if anything like this came back to Morton again I'd be assured to be there you know it'd be absolutely fantastic. I think all the practice and stuff and then you, you come to a different surrounding so you don't need these people so you're going to be a bit anxious and you know but once you once you sit there and you have the group and they're playing along you get into that rhythm and I just just let it go with me you know. And do you think you're going to um, vote when it comes round to your turn to, for voting? Yeah, 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 yeah. I think the young people performed absolutely fantastically. Um, I had no idea that uh, there was going to be so much energy in the room. The ballot boxes are absolutely superb, the different colours, the techniques. And then to see um, a group of young people so engaged in the music they were making, uh, a community spirit, and really getting the message across about um, Democracy Rocks and making ballot boxes funky was just absolutely fantastic. I thought it was absolutely brilliant. The standard of performance was superb. And to see everyone involved in giving it their all and how the ballot boxes have been transformed as well. It. So I hope both people take things away sort of artistically and musically and democratically, if you like, that they've thought about the issues and they continue to think about them.